This is video six of my nuclear medicine series where I'm going to go through certain exams. I'm going to tell you what they are, what we're looking for, and show you some cool pictures. Quick anatomy lesson. So all of the blood from your body gets to your heart through these vessels here. They're going to go into your right ventricle, which then gets pumped to your lungs in order to get oxygenated, and then comes back into your left ventricle. Now, the left ventricle is what we are looking at today, okay? It's called a myocardial perfusion scan or a MIVI scan or a stress test. They get all sorts of different kinds of names, but what we're looking at specifically is this muscular section of the left ventricle, that little U right there. Okay, now we look at it by cutting it in slices as if it was like a cup. Okay, so your axial one is going to be from the tip going up, then you've got a horizontal cut and a vertical cut. Now we do two sets of pictures, one when your heart is resting and one when your heart is at stress. Okay, so what the difference should be between the two is when your heart is at stress, your blood vessels should get bigger in order to accommodate a higher amount of blood flow that your heart needs in order to be pumping harder. If those blood vessels don't get bigger like they should, then you can have a greater risk of a heart attack. This is called ischemia. And ischemia shows up on these pictures as a lack of brightness of this orange or um, yellowy color. The top line up there, that's normal looking. This bottom one down here, this is what ischemia would look like. There can be a dumb bunch of different um, shapes and different places depending on where that lack of blood flow is at is going to be where the um, lack of activity is in the pictures. There's a few more things that I want to tell you that I want to go over because these scans are super cool. So hang on, I'm going to make a part two.